morning, people. Today at Conservative Party conference, Jeremy Hunt, the guy in charge of the economy, managed to capture pretty much everything that's wrong with the Conservative Party in less than 55 seconds. Seriously, all the clips that I'm about to show you happened one after the other, and it's less than a minute. So let's go through it. That means, amongst other things, changing our approach to equality and diversity initiatives. Smashing glass ceilings is everyone's job not a box to be ticked by hiring a diversity manager. That right there is the typical I don't see color approach to inequality, where you constantly smack down any effort to improve equality without ever offering any alternatives. Because when he says it's everybody's job to improve diversity, he's saying, just let things be, people will sort things out. Even though his government published a report that shows that subconscious biases makes it up to 90% harder for minority ethnic people to get hired. So they know damn well that people won't just sort this out. And this is how they maintain systemic inequality in society. And in literally the next breath, he says, But I'm going to surprise you with one equality and diversity initiative of my own. And trust me, no, you'll like this one. <laughs> Nobody should have their bank account closed because somebody else decides they're not politically correct. That's a reference to Nigel Farage being kicked off his bank account. So literally, screw minorities, we're going with the racists. And did you notice how before he basically said, screw minorities, we're going with racists, he said, trust me, you'll like this one, and everybody laughed. That's the culture war. That's them deliberately playing to racist voters to try and win elections. And that should tell you everything you need to know about who the Tories really care about, because the people of the UK are experiencing the sharpest fall in living standards ever recorded, and the Tories are on record as admitting that their Brexit is making people poorer. But are the Tories willing to do anything about it? No, but what they will do is help racist millionaires with their customer services complaints. We'll tighten the law to stop people being debanked for the wrong political views. The Lib Dems are wrong to want to overturn a democratic Brexit vote. Jeremy Hunt is the Chancellor. He's in charge of the economy, and he's on record as saying that not being in the EU single market is damaging the UK economy. Not to mention, in 2016, he said that Brexit would make our public finances disappear, a price that would be paid by the poorest in society. Yet to score political points, he's still willing to say that other parties were wrong to oppose Brexit. The Lib Dems are wrong to want to overturn a democratic Brexit vote but they still need a cash point to withdraw their euros. And there he is implying the people who disagree with the Tories on Brexit are somehow less British, less patriotic, which is textbook fascism, implying that your political opponents are somehow less patriotic than you. And calling Brexit democratic when you literally had to call a general election to get around the other Brexit supporting parties who oppose your version of Brexit is textbook populism, pretending that you embody the will of the people despite all evidence to the contrary. So well done to Jeremy, because throw in a dash of criminality and that hunt really nailed the concern to party. I'm Femi, this has been F Politics, just trying to make sure that politics doesn't F you. Have a great week.